Good morning, YouTube fam. It is Monday, August 12th. Um, it's like 9.30 in the morning. I just, as you guys saw, made my coffee. Um, <clears throat> put like a little bit of protein dolce de leche in there, which is my jam, as you guys know. Um, but yeah, just wanted to say hello. It hasn't been, it's been a second since I actually like vlogged, uh, so this is going to be fun. I missed it. Um, and I actually did find out that if, if you guys have been watching my videos, you know that my camera's broken. Um, and I actually did find out that I am going to get it repaired. However, they called me like three days ago and they were like, your camera hasn't been shipped. I'm like, I haven't heard a word about shipping it. Like, I never, I still have not heard back from the insurance company except this one phone call. Um, so I'm like, how was I supposed to know that I was supposed to send it if I never got any information or an address to send it to? So that's great. Um, <laughs> But yeah, that's where we're at right now. Um, I am very tired and I think I'm getting sick. I've had to close the bar at work the last like six days in a row. Um, so I'm very tired. My body is like, give us a break. Uh, today's my first day off in a really long time and I'm just like really looking forward to it. I'm going to make the best of it. Going to hopefully have a really productive and good day. Um, really excited to go train for the first time since Thursday. Um, and yeah, that's where we're at right now. I feel like a little bit of a marshmallow, but you know, as is life. Um, so yeah, that's kind of where we're at right now. I need this. So, anyway, now that I'm done having my moment of my first sip of coffee, uh, I'm gonna drink this. I'm gonna make some breakfast in a moment. I will show you guys that. And, yeah, I will catch up with you guys in a little bit. Alright, so this morning's breakfast, we did... I did, like, two pieces of this toast. Uh, this is from Aldi, and this bread is so good. Um, and I did one with a little bit of avocado. And then this one, I put one of these pepper jack cheese wedges on, and I did three egg whites, like, uh, from an egg, and then I did, like, half of an egg yolk. I didn't mean to do the egg yolk, but it kind of just broke, and I kind of just had to go with it. Um, and then I just finished off a carton of egg whites, so yeah, there's, like, a lot of protein in here. And then I did a quarter of a serving of this, and yeah, I'm so hungry right now. I'm so excited to eat this. Um... We're going to eat this, and then I'm going to go get ready to go to the gym, I think. I don't know. We'll see. Um, but, yeah, that's the current situation. So, I will catch up with you guys in a little bit. All right. It's like 10.10 currently, and I am heading out to the gym. Oh, shit. Ah. Um, this is probably a bad idea because I have to be home by 11.45. But... I just want to get it out of the way. Why won't my fence latch? Damn it. All right. Yeah, we have to, we're buying, um, so my boyfriend, Zach, and I, we love the Lumineers, the band, and they are coming to Columbus this, on his birthday, which is February 4th. Um, so today we are buying tickets for that because they like go on pre-sale or whatever. Um, so I have to be home to buy the tickets, but I'd rather get my workout done in the morning. Because I have so much other stuff I need to do today. Um, so yeah, we're gonna head to the gym right now. We're gonna hit some back. And yeah, we'll catch up with you guys afterwards. Hello, it's like noon right now and I am currently sitting on the Ticketmaster website trying to get these Lumineers tickets. I did make it in and out of the gym in an hour, so I'm very proud of myself. Um, got a decent back day in, saw my friend Ava. And yeah, that was good. But now we're gonna do this. And then I think I might go to the grocery store. We'll see. Or I don't know, I have to make food. Um, and I need to, I need groceries, but yeah, so we'll see. Um, I'm kind of mad because I just want, I need like a yogurt, but I, and I had one, but I left it at work by accident. So now I'm like, why didn't I just bring it home with me? Um, but yeah, so I'm going to try and get these tickets. I don't know if it's going to work. We're really hoping. Um, so we shall see. But anyway, I will probably update you guys whenever I... And I'm making my post workout meal. All right, so we got our concert tickets. I'm so excited. We literally just bought them for fucking February, but we're, uh, you know, just gotta be ahead of the game. Um, so yeah, I think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna go to the grocery store and then come back and make my post workout meal. I usually like to eat things like I usually have to eat a, eat them closer to when I'm actually done at the gym, but 
today I, I don't know, I really want a smoothie and I really want to make it with yogurt. So we're gonna go get some groceries. Maybe I'll throw a little grocery haul in here. Uh, it's depending on how much I get. We'll see. Sorry, I'm trying to find a shirt to wear to the grocery store. <laughs> but, what is this? Um, but yeah, I'm just gonna go to Aldi. There's an Aldi really close to my new house, which is really nice. What is that? Oh, it's a hairball. I thought it was a fucking bug. I was like, why is there a hairball? Why is there a bug in my laundry? But it was actually not a bug. You ever have days when you like look through your closet and you're like, wow, where are all my clothes? But they're all literally in front of your face and you just, I don't know. Uh, I'm so tired, but we are do doing our best anyway. Found it. I was looking for a specific tank top um, and it was located. But all right, I'm gonna put this on. We're gonna go to Aldi and yeah, I will uh, show you guys everything that I get, I suppose. Hello, I just got back from Aldi. It's like, 115 I think um, I got everything laid out behind me so I figured I'll just run through everything really fast I got kind of a lot um, I really didn't mean to but it just happened I even like went with a list and everything and I really just I didn't even get that much that I didn't mean to get I just whatever it happened and we're gonna talk about it and yeah I don't know well, let's just let's just get into it so starting with like carb sources I got some potatoes Bread, this bread is literally so good, guys. And like, look at how massive these slices are. Like, that's my hand for reference. Um, and then I got some pretzels, some rice, mango chunks, and um, some mixed fruit, which is strawberries, pineapples, peaches, mango. These have been, are for smoothies, but we're gonna make a smoothie in a second. Um, I got a bunch of yogurts. I really love these, like, skier, skir, I don't know, these uh, vanilla ones, they're so yummy uh, in smoothies, and then I just got um, just some flavored ones in case I decided I wanted those, some shrimp, I had a huge bag of salmon, but I think it was like $7.50 for this whole thing, and there's like, I don't know, a million servings, and it says eight, but there's usually extra, um, and then I got two things, eggs, eggs at all, you're only 75 cents, like it's silly. Um, I got three cans of tuna, some egg whites, my literal obsession right now. I got some black bean chipotle burgers. Macros on these are not terrible. Ideally, no, maybe. I don't know, you can barely see it. But yeah, ideally these would have a little more protein in them. But these are good for days that like I kind of go over my protein and I want something for dinner that's not like super high in protein. Um, I got an avocado, two things of riced cauliflower, um, these artisan heads of lettuce. I don't know, I've been into them lately. They're yummy. They're like, I think they're just romaine, but they're kind of like small romaine. Maybe, I don't know, I could be wrong. Um, and then zucchini, some butter lettuce, Brussels sprouts, asparagus, and some coffee. So yeah, that's, that's what we're working with. Oh, hi. Hey. Hi. Um, so yeah, and everything here was like, I think it was $62, um, which really isn't too bad, I don't think. And all of this is gonna feed me for a really long time. Um, some of this stuff like Mikey and Zach eat too, but most of this is just for me, just cause they, I don't know, eat very different than I do. Um, but you know, like eggs, bread, I don't know, potatoes. If they ever want veggies, they're happy. They're, they won't help themselves. Um, we do share some stuff. So, we do share some stuff, but for the most part, I still grocery shop pretty much for myself. Um, just because it's easier and, I don't know. They eat a lot of meat and I don't eat meat, so that's where we're at with things. Um, but yeah, so that's my little grocery haul. Um, not super exciting, I know, but you know, I thought I would share anyway. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna put this all away and then I'm gonna make a smoothie and I'll catch up with you guys afterwards. All right, so we are about to blend this, but I figured I would show you guys what I put in it before. So I did a serving and a half of this, I did a serving of this, I did one of these little yogurty guys, focus. And then I did a little less than half a scoop of this. Um, I did some almond milk, I'm probably gonna have to add more. And yeah, that is smoothie, I suppose. And there we have it, the finished product. I literally just eat it straight out of here. Um, put some granola in it, I'll show that to you guys in a second. But before I do that, I figured 
I should talk about this blender because this blender is literally life-changing. It's not really like a blender. It is, but it isn't. I don't know, I don't know how to explain it. But yeah, so you put this little lid on it, if I can get it on right. And then this thing attaches to the top, and then you just hold it down. And it blends. And it's literally the easiest thing ever. And then you just pull this little blender piece out, and boom! You have a smoothie and a bowl, and it's wonderful. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna put some of this on there, and a little bit of this, and that will be post-workout, lunch, meal, breakfast, I don't know, it's like 1.30, but yeah, that's, that's what we're working with. I don't know where this blender is from, by the way, I have no idea. I'm guessing Amazon, if I can find it on Amazon, I'll, I'll leave a link in the description. Um, but yeah, this thing is seriously amazing. Like, I don't know. I, the blender that I used, that I had at my old house was actually garbage. Um, and this thing is so easy to use, so easy to clean. Um, but yeah, I just figured I would talk about that really fast in case anyone cares. And here we have the final product. This has literally been like my obsession recently is coming home and making a giant smoothie. I am loving eating my biggest meal of the day post-workout and then I just like am so full and so satisfied for hours um and it's just wonderful so many nutrients so delicious here I mean I'll show you guys the macros in this I guess in case anyone cares um this is a very very carb dense meal um which I personally enjoy especially post-workout um, okay, yeah so 70.4 carb 11.6 fat 36.7 protein yeah this is my jam but yeah, so right now I'm gonna hang out, I'm gonna sit, I'm gonna eat this, I'm gonna skim through Lyle McDonald's women's book for a little while, do some personal training prep because my new job is starting soonish, so I wanna get some like business ideas before I do that. And yeah, just kinda hang out for a little while, try and get some stuff done. And yeah, I hope this was kind of interesting. Well, I hope you're enjoying the video so far, I guess. Um, and also, I don't. I've never really included my macros for like meals in full days of eating, but if people did care, if people wanted to see that, I totally will. I have no problem doing that. Um, as long as, you know, I'll, you know, you just gotta know that like what works for me isn't gonna work for you. I don't even know if what I'm doing works for me, to be honest. I just kind of hang out where I'm at and I don't really like, I don't know. I pretty much just track my prog progress through pictures. Like I don't like weigh myself or do anything like that. Um, but yeah, anyway, long story short, if you want to see macros included in future videos, full day eating uh, videos, uh, let me know and we can do that. Let me know in the comments. But yeah, I will, um, I'm going to eat this, hang out for a little while, and I will catch up with you guys later. I haven't moved very much. Um, it's like 2.30. I finished my smoothie a little while ago, but it's lighting kind of funky. But yeah, now I'm just hanging. I made another coffee. I just added some almond milk and a little cinnamon. Just reading, taking some notes on birth control and the effects of physiology. Got my little study buddy. Hi, bud. Um, yeah, that's what's going on right now. I'm washing my sheets right now. Um, I think I'm gonna end up like deep cleaning the house in a little while too, just because I haven't done that in days because I've been working so much. So my house is a little gross. I just need to sweep them up the floors and finish cleaning off the kitchen cabinet, the cat counters and stuff like that, and I think I'm gonna clean the bathroom. Um, but yeah, I might end up doing that in like a couple hours. I just wanna get some knowledge time in because I haven't had any time to do focus on that kind of stuff recently. Not, I've also just been kind of lazy about it over the summer because I was taking that accounting class and now that accounting's over, I'm like, might as well learn some fun stuff that I actually care about. Um, so yeah, that's what we're doing. And also, Lyle McDonald's, the women's book that I just showed you guys a little while ago. That book, there's so much information in it. Like, if you want like an interesting book on women's health, it's really useful and has a lot of really good information. 10 out of 10 recommended. It's on the expensive side, I will not lie to you. But it is 100% worth it, the information. It is amazing, and yeah, it's like 500 pages. So, definitely recommend. I wish I should, I should really wanted the hard copy, but that's uh, a lot of doll hairs. So I would rather spend less doll hairs and not have the physical book basically so yeah that's what we're doing right now i'm gonna drink this coffee i know it's like 2 30 and i probably shouldn't be drinking coffee because i want to go to bed at like nine but i don't know i just, I just kind of want it i honestly might not even end up drinking the whole thing but it's part of a full day beating so i have to include it right right yes pablo calm down all right study time okay hello friends it's like 4 
40 at the moment. Um, and I just made a little snack and I just made up my greens and collagen, um, which I started mixing with, I'll just show you guys. Um, I started mixing it with a little bit of this, like, I don't know, three or four ounces worth, um, on top of some water uh, with like the greens and the collagen. Yeah. Uh, yeah, mixing all that together with some water has been really good. And then I also just have some tuna and some crackers. I just make my tuna with like a can of tuna. I do some little avocado and then one of those pepper jack cheese wedges. I eat like nine a day. Not really, usually like two, but yeah. And then some everything pretzels. Showed you guys in the grocery haul. Yeah, I'm still just hanging out, reading. I just cleaned our bedroom, washed the sheets, I already said that. Um, did a little cleaning in the kitchen. Yeah, I'm just trying to get my life in order. I'm like taking like study breaks like in between just like going and cleaning. Um, but now we're having a little snack break. I honestly might just like watch a YouTube video for a little while and then, I don't know, we shall see. Probably not gonna do a whole lot tonight because it's been a long few days and I need to just relax and yeah. I still kind of need to go to the bank. I don't know if that's gonna happen, we'll find out. Um, current situation and I'm gonna eat this, hang out for a little while. And I'll probably catch up with you guys when we ever meet whenever we make dinner. Alright, we're having a stir fry party for dinner. Yay, stir fry. Yeah. So <laughs> this is just rice, cauliflower rice, broccoli, zucchini, shrimp, teriyaki sauce. I just get this at Aldi. It's wonderful. We should probably turn this burner off. That's probably a good idea. Um, and yeah, that's just how it's, how we're doing it right now. So, they eat chicken, I obviously do not, so we just like cook everything separately and then kind of just like throw it all together at the end, it just makes it way easier. You know, you can make things work for you. So, that is dinner. Uh, <laughs> we're gonna eat this and see where the rest of the night takes us, except it's just gonna take us right to bed in about half an hour, so that's good. Hey, hi, it's like nine, no, it's 8.35, just kidding. Um, and I am literally about to go to bed, except um, I'm just gonna show you guys my last like snack, meal, whatever. I need one of these perfect bars, it has the dark chocolate chip peanut butter ones in my favorite bar. Um, I said apparently they have a cookie dough one, which I'm pretty sure I would like more, but until then, this is my favorite. Um, these are really good because I realized that I had like a shit ton of fat slump today. Um, and this thing is like 19 years of fat, so it's a good way to get fats in if you struggle with that. Um, I probably should have eaten like an entire egg this morning instead of just egg whites, but it ain't that serious. Um, I like my peanut butter anyway. But yeah, I'm about to go to bed. I'm so tired. Like, I, as the day has gone on, like, I have just gotten progressively, like, more and more exhausted. Like, my body is just like, my shoulders hurt. I have such a bad headache. Like, I... Being up until like four in the morning, four days in a row, and waking up at eight is just like, and it's not even like I try to wake up early, my body just like wakes me up then, and it's super stupid. Um, so I'm just like exhausted, but yeah, I've said that enough times. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it was kind of not that exciting because all I did was like work out and sit in all day. Um, but yeah, hopefully you had some like grocery ideas or something. Um, I'm actually probably gonna go sit in bed and start editing this video right now so I can get it up tomorrow. Dogs are freaking out behind me. Just look at them. Okay. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna eat this perfect bar. Gonna take my fish oil, my probiotic, and iron, and then I'm gonna go to bed because, yeah, my goal is to be in bed by nine. Um, I honestly might even take a little bit of melatonin, and I'm gonna take some CBD, which is over here. Remember that you can use the code CMJones, fit, dot fit, um, 15% off CBD. Um, Bloom Farms has like seriously been so helpful. That's like the only reason that I can fall asleep when I home from work at like four in the morning is like because of the stuff I'm taking every night. It doesn't help me stay asleep really, but it does help me like fall asleep when I'm like really like awake after work. Oh, someone's having a country party outside. Um, but yeah, I hope that was sort of, I don't know, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, hopefully I'm going to film another full day meeting later in the week as well, and then I'm going to send out my camera, hopefully get it fixed. So 
but life just gets a little bit easier for me. Um, but until then, I hope you are having a wonderful day wherever you are in the world, and I will, yeah, I'll see you guys next one. Make sure to just hit the thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and uh, subscribe if you haven't already. And yeah, see you in my next video.